All right, hello everyone. Welcome back to Knuckle Sandwich. So we are about to enter the cruise now. Uh, the cruise ship. We just finished at the arcade in South City. So I, I, ooh, wait. Echo's at the beach. Can we go there? I'm trying to see if you could go through these rocks. Doesn't look like it. Oh! Okay, I got that far, but that's as far as I was able to get. Oh, you can go say hi to Echo. When I was little, I would explore the beach early in the morning. Sometimes I find stuff in the sand. Is that a hint that there's something in the sand somewhere? Ah, uh, maybe it's in that one little area that I, uh... I pushed the A button everywhere. I didn't get anything. All right. Let's go this way. Beautiful ocean. Got some wind, too. Oh, Dolus! Hi. The others aren't here yet. For some reason, my next star edition. Weird. Ask about Dolus. What, what? Ask about him. Me? I try to do my best. The bright fangs? That gang? I don't really like him. Mr. Apricot? That rich man? He looks like an apricot. Yeah, I guess. I guess we can stop talking. Ah, uh, what do you have to say about Gorilla Burger? The diner? I think we're in over our heads. <laughs> He's just blunt, straight to the point. There's Thea and the Echo. Hey, what are we waiting for? Let's get on this ship. All right, let's go. Oh, hello. I'm not sure what to talk about. <laughs> oh, it's Thessamon or whatever his name is. It's me, P Persimon. Thessamon. We met at Apricot Resort. It's so nice to see you again. Welcome to the SS Andy, Mr. Apricot's luxury cruise ship. Only people with a valid ticket are permitted to board. Do you have one? I flashed the cruise ticket. Let me see. Wow, a VIP ticket. Okay, all of you can board the ship. Enjoy the Apricot experience. Well, it sure is a cruise ship. I feel like I've been here before. Echo, have I been here before? Uh, no? Neat! We'll leave her to that. I think we should try to find Mr. Apricot. But it wouldn't hurt to look around a bit first. I'm gonna head outside. I'll catch up with you two later. Did he join my party? I guess not. Some rooms and stuff over here. Locked. Not much in these rooms, really. Promenade deck, lower deck. Ooh, an item in here. Fishing bait. Put it in your pocket for later. Huh. Bait used to catch fish. Have you heard of the Bright Fangs? They're horrible. I heard they want to take over the city. Locked. Locked. Okay. <laughs> Just got tossed out of there. Bottle of Cola Deluxe. Nice. What does that do again? That's really useful, right? 40 HP, wow. Oh, look, like a nice little heal and sword room. Very nice. Alright, I'll probably uh, keep everything I have for right now. The 
deposit that. So this is the promenade day deck or whatever. Nice to see you here. I hope you're ready to have some fun. I love the ocean. Is this like an area you can walk to over here? Access to upper deck and dining hall. Maybe I should have went to the lower deck first. Let's go see. I know I'm wasting a lot of time by backtracking here, but I'm just curious. I wish he ran a little bit faster. That's my one gripe with uh, Protag. He doesn't run fast enough. I like the music, though. Oh, it's being blocked. Sorry, pal. I can't let any guests into the lower deck. Okay. So I can't go in the lower deck yet. I should have uh, went to the right first. Oh, well. So we'll have to go to the dining hall and probably the other room and see what's up that way. Did I go in the laundry yet? I think I did. Yeah, that was the room where I was able to save. I just felt better about going, hey, I went to that area, I didn't skip it. Okay, can't go really lower deck yet, but... Is this more rooms up here? Locked, 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 locked. Hey, yeah, these are all locked! Locked. Jeez. Locked. Hey, it's the fitness people. Nice to see you. Have a good time. Okay. Oh. Another laundry room? Huh. Wait. I guess this is a different floor of more rooms. This is a big ship. There's, yeah, this is another... Okay, laundry room. Oh! Cure all. Cure any status condition. It's a neat little item. What did that... I gotta see what that sign says. We forgot to furnish this room. Sorry. Okay. Nice to see you here. This is where we come to rest. Absolutely nothing out of the ordinary is going on. That's a little suspicious. June 20th, I saw the wildest creature out in the ocean. There was no way it was a person. What could it mean? Why am I writing this? Game turning into like a horror game? What'd that say? The thing is spotless. The cleaner must have cleaned here recently. Oh. Bright side. Whoa! I bet you're wondering what I'm doing here. Well, I stuck on board to see if I'd get a reward for saving Mr. Apricot's life. But the game mean nothing, so I'm gonna go see what I can swipe from this joint on my way out. You gonna try to stop me? Well, I guess I gotta fight him, huh? Okay. I'm gonna get you this time. Puppy snack. That's up. One, two, three, attack. Count. Oh, one, two, jeez. I think it's seven. Wow, I got it. Good guess, huh? That didn't do much. Eh, that's my party. We'll try beat down. I hate this attack. Oh, I got it! That was the first time I've done that one. Jank attack. Rock, paper, scissors. Oh, I tied him. There's been a lot of tying on that one. Alright, here comes beat down. Hopefully I can make him dizzy.
Nice, I made him dizzy. Now, his attacks will miss. Alright, now I just gotta fight him. He'll miss no matter what here, which is good. Yeah, I dodged it anyway. Return to normal, too. Good. I only got a seven combo. Yeah, not good. Did he just heal his. Dodged him again. <laughs> These fights feel a little bit scripted. Or like you're not able to actually like get rid of him. Oh no, okay, I see his health bar. He doesn't have much left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I count eight. See ya. Yep, I got rid of him. Nice. No experience for that fight? Fine, I'll behave myself. Weird character. Alright. Mr. Apricot. Hello, my friend. Glad you could make it. So cheery. Must be excited to visit a thousand futures, yes? I can't wait for a perfect version of Bright City. How exciting is that? Anyway, we are settling we are setting sail tonight, settling. So I hope you did everything you need before we leave. Are you ready to go? Let's go. Brilliant, let's head up to the pool. Oh, wait. I wasn't able to get the item from his office. Oops. I guess I shouldn't have clicked that. Oh well. That's right, everybody dance. Isn't this the best? I'm glad you can make it on this trip. And you even brought some new friends. What a delight. You're all my special guests, so kick back and relax. Sure nice of you to invite us, Mr. Apricot. I can't believe you're in such high spirits after what happened at the resort. I forgot about that. <laughs> First of all, Ms. Apricot, sir, excuse my interruption, but our guests are having some problems. Truth be told, there are too many complaints. We are dramatically understaffed. <laughs> Sounds like a Taro problem. He's in charge of staff relations. Where is Taro anyway? I totally forgot about him during all that Bright Fang commotion. Looks like we'll need some extra help around here. How about it? I guess. You all dabble in hospitality. You must love this line of work. I think we will need two more people to help. How about... You. And... Dolus. Dolus. What's a Dolus? <laughs> Dolus joined your party. Perfect. Welcome to the Apricot Enterprises family. Hold on one second. Get these two to work. Staff are not allowed to attend my parties. Jeez. Okay, listen up, you two. We have many guests with many issues. I need you to go to the following rooms. 13, 22, 27. There are guest rooms to your left and right. Read the signs on the walls if you need help with directions. If you see any other Apricot Corp employees, you can ask them for help. Talk to me when you're finished. Alright, so I have Dolus now, right? He's level 15. He's actually, like, much lower than me. Friend Dimension is a pretty useful one. What are his stats again? He has high attack. Wow. Really high attack. He doesn't even have a weapon. So I can go get him one. Deposit the cure all for now and withdraw. What should I give him? I guess the only thing I really have is the Bunko Blade. I have the Cricket Bat, which is plus 16 defense. I would like him to be strong though. Maybe I'll just give him the Bunko Blade. Let's look at his stats real quick. 
He's actually quite speedy, too. Oh, it's plus six defense. I didn't even realize. It's actually not really that bad of an item. I gave it to him, and he's gonna... Hold. Wait, why is it one-handed now? He's able to carry two items? In is that a glitch? I don't know if it is, but now I can give him, like, the cricket bat as well, I guess. That's interesting. I don't think that's supposed to happen. <laughs> He's able to hold the Bunko Blade and the Cricket Bat at the same time? That seems a little OP. 53D and 84 speed. I mean, 84 attack. Look at, look at him holding both weapons. That's amazing. Is he just that good normally? Maybe he is. I don't know. Now, I want to save... But I also want to go get that item from the room that I didn't get. Okay, so I think it was... This way, right? I definitely want to, like, get through this part of the game, but I want to go back to his office really quick. And then we'll come back. And I gotta remember what, what rooms to help out too. I guess I'll just remember in the next episode. I'll have to uh, refresh my memory. This is his room, right? Good, I can go get this item. What was it? Scissors. They're surprisingly sharp. Okay, what do they do? Plus 16 attack? Holy heck. That does raise my speed. Okay, let's... That's plus 16 attack. The Bunko Blade is only plus 12. But I could also make him just absolutely elite if I get rid of the Cricket Bat. Okay, so... Let's... Let's do this. It's a tough decision. Because I could raise his speed with the Bunko Bat. So Camp Knife is plus 10, plus 4. And that's plus 16 plus 14. See, so what I'm gonna do is take, give, hold the scissors. So now I have plus 16 attack times two. And now I'm gonna have him hold that over the cricket bat. When you go to the party, now he has 94 attack. Jeez. My team is OP now. I, I didn't think I'd be able to get the stats up that high, but my goodness, they are they are battle ready now, and I can put the cricket bat back. Little excited over exchanging these weapons, but I mean, I'm a force to be reckoned with now, to be honest. All right, so I just realized this is a nice uh, laundry room, but I can't put the other item I have away. I still want to put that weapon back, so we're gonna head back, which is fine, because then I can re. Oh, that door just came out to attack me. By the way. We'll come back, that's no problem, but what I'm actually gonna do is go back to that first laundry room right here and deposit that other weapon I had, the cricket bat. Um, there we go. So everything looks pretty good to me. Um, I don't know if I need any other items. Maybe I'll withdraw the uh, cure-all, just so they both have one slot open. Okay, and that'll be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. We're finally on the cruise ship. Cruise ship. Got a really good item. So excited for this chapter, man. I'll see you guys for the next one. Hey guys, thanks for watching another episode of Knuckle Sandwich. Please drop a like, a comment, and subscribe. It all really helps me. See you guys soon.